What is up, my dudes? It's your boy, Easy Peasy Ham and Cheesy, back with another video. And firstly, I'm just, I'm incredibly sorry that, um, Sunday and Monday didn't have any videos. But, um, I'm gonna, well, you guys will see, I dropped two videos on Tuesday. So, just to try to make up, uh, make up for it. But, I'm sorry, I just, I, uh had a, a, l a little personal stuff going on but n nothing serious at all and i lost track of time and but we'll get back on track now so yeah let's let's get into it so he sends out a glaley and a sock i'm going to use protect just to see um i guess i'll knock off on glaley cuz it'll it won't be, or actually, I could hidden power Glalie, so I might as well protect and knock off Sock. Just uh, to protect myself, because Glalie is probably going to attack Vileplume, because that's super effective, and Sock's probably going to attack Mammal Swine, because that's super effective. And. Oh, Glalie Mega Evolved. I protected. He hit me with an Ice Shard, but I lived it. He hit me with a Rock Slide. Oh, Sock used Rock Slide, so I protected myself. I knocked Sock off. Knocked off a Life Orb. So, I'm gonna... What? Let me just... Alright, good. He's still an Ice Type, so I'm gonna hit him with a, a Hidden Power Fire and a Knock Off. To knock, cause hidden power fight him. It's fire. It's not stab. But never mind. Um, I was gonna say it won't do enough, but he just took out mammal swine. I hit him with the hidden power, and it didn't do enough to take him down. But now it just comes down to who am I gonna send out now? I don't wanna send out Agron because he is four times super effective. I'm gonna send out Metacham. So I'm super effective at unsock. I'm gonna hit Glalie with another hidden power and then fake out sock Cuz it'll do uh, It'll whoops hidden power. I just wanna Uh-huh, it'll flinch and uh, sock It'll do a good amount of damage to sock because of his lower defense So yeah, I'm um, again. I'm really sorry but you got two videos on Tuesday, and I'll be able to, like, upload and make videos much more constantly now, because I'm on break from school for the rest of this week. But he did take me down with a, a file plume, or, um, a, a thing, freeze dry. All my Pokemon are weak to fighting. I mean, I might as well just send out- Oh no, he is freeze dry! Okay, freeze dry will be neutral though, so that's better. I'm gonna icy wind both of them, and drain punch Glalie, cause icy wind will lower their speed and it should uh drain punch should take out the Glalie. So now that I'm thinking of no yeah, just in case, um, well it'll lower both of their speeds and just in case it doesn't take it out. But it's not going to matter because he one-shot Lapras. He hit me with a freeze right? Didn't do all that much. But I hit him with a drain punch and it did do a lot. It one-shot him actually. But now I need to figure out how to beat Saw. I, I think I have a psychic type move. I mean, um. No, I don't. So I'm just, I'll send in. Oh, no. I mean, I guess it's better that I sent Tr Tyrantrum in because Nido Queen would be four times super effective. I'm gonna Ice Fang Nido Queen so it'll be super effective. And then. Screw it, I'll Drain Punch Sock. So it'll do a good amount of damage and. Um, his speed, he hit me with a close combat and I went down. The sock is, I can't stop it, but I do stop it. I hit him with a drain punch, steals energy for myself, and I went in. And then he hits me with a sludge bomb. 
So it's all up to Agron and a very weak Medicham. He sends out a Ludicolo. That's not the Agron. I'm going to Mega Evolve. Oh, um, Sock wouldn't, would have only been one time super effective if I, when I Mega Evolved. So it's not as bad as I thought it was. Huh. 120. Wait. Um. Huh. I'm not quite sh I'm. What should I. Rock slide, I guess, because it'll hit both. And then I'm gonna Ice Punch Nido Queen, but it, I'm gonna lose. Hit him with an Ice Punch, and it does a lot. But I'm gonna go down. He takes out Agron with the Earth Power. And then takes out Medicham with the Giga Drain. So I lost that first battle, but it's alright. I'll just shake it off my back, get into another one. He sends out a Dewblade and a Pikachu. I send out a Rayquaza and an Electros. Um, I'm gonna use a special defense. Um... What's my item? A Yachi Berry. It's probably like ice type moves don't do as much. Screw it. Recreate uh, Dewblade and uh, knock off uh, knock off Pikachu. He used Thunderbolt on me. I used Recreate on him and it did basically the same amount. I hit Pikachu with a knock off and it did more than Recreate. Dewblade Sword Stance is up, so I'm going to switch out. I don't have any ground types, unfortunately. But I do have another dragon type, so I'm going to switch out. And then, knock off the Dewblade. Switched out to the Kamoa, whoa, whoa. He Shadow Sneaked Electros. Hit Kamoa with a Thunderbolt, and it didn't do much, but it did paralyze. And then I used a super effective knockoff and knocked off his Eevee Light. Clanging Scales. Sure, I'll use that because it'll take down both of them. And then I'm gonna knock off. Oh, well, it'll take down Dewblade and do damage to Pikachu. And then I'm gonna knock off um, Pikachu. He E speed, but I lived it. Shadow sneaked Kamoa, but he lived it. I one shot Pikachu with a knockoff. Hit him with the clanging scales and he went down, but my defense did lower. Um, but I'm going to use my Z move next turn unless he sends out like a fair two fairy types. I hope he doesn't send out two fairy types. I uh, send out a Lilligant and a Jinx. I'm going to hit him with the Clangorous Soul Blaze. It'll raise my defense back up. And then I'm going to knock off Jinx. He psychics and one-shots me. So I guess I'm not going to Clangorous Soul Blaze. Took out, and then he put Lilligant to sleep. I'm going to send out Mincho. Oh, I, I probably shouldn't have done that. Do I have Bullet Punch or something that outspeed? No. I'm going to knock off Jinx, but I probably won't live to do it. And then I'll use a U-turn on Lilligant if I wake up, which I probably won't. So hopefully, maybe, possibly I'll get that far. Um, oh, I, well, I outsped one shot not and one shot him with a knockoff. Hit me with a pedal dance, and I would go to an Electros went down. I'm gonna send out Mawile, and I'm, I, t I actually took the lead, which is cool. He sends out a Heliolisk, and now I'm gonna high jump kick him, because it'll be super effective, but I won't outspeed. And I'm gonna Mega Evolve and Fire Fang Lilligan. Oh, Helio Heliolisk protects while well, take f half my health and damage. He pedal danced Mincho and took out the other half. But I hit Lilligant with a Fire Fang and it did a lot. But I'm going to send out Rayquaza. Um, 
And I'm gonna use Tailwind, because it'll probably be helpful. And then protect myself. He missed a thunder. Petal Dance Mawile, but I live, but I protected. And then Tailwind, Tailwinded up. So my speed is increased, but it doesn't say it is, so that's kind of weird. I'm gonna Dragon Claw Lilligant. No, I'm not gonna. I'm gonna Dragon Claw, Halilisk, and Fire Fang Lilligant. Dragon Claw did a lot, Fire Fang did more, and took out the Lil Lilligant. He hit me with the Thunder, and I went down. But it's up to Feraligator, who just so happens to be weak to Electric. But my speed is boosted, so I'm going to Earthquake and Protect. And that'll be super effective against both of them, actually. I protect myself. And I hit him with an earthquake. Takes down healer with Oh, and bug resists ground, so it's not super effective. And then he mega horns Mawile, but I live. But he's just gonna keep getting faster until he eventually outspeeds the uh, tailwind. But I'm for alligator it's gonna dragon dance up. And then I'm gonna use knock off to knock off whatever item it has. He hit me with a mega horn. I resisted it. I dragon danced up, hit him with a knockoff, did a ton of damage, and his speed rose, but I'm gonna just Aqua Jet, which will, actually no, yeah, I'm gonna Aqua Jet, which is priority, and then Fire Fang, and, that, and I'll take the W. So, won the first battle, lo or lo lost the first one, won the second. It all comes down to this, unless someone forfeits, like a coward, because people who forfeit are... I, I, ran, I ran a multi-year study of people who forfeit constantly, especially against me in Pokemon Showdown, and it found that all of those people are bad people who deserve to not be able to play Pokemon Showdown. Because if you want to play Pokemon Showdown, why would you quit playing it? it doesn't make any sense. Hmm. <laughs> so, I send out a Crowdon and a Feraligator. He sends out a Mandibuzz and an Aromatisse. I'm going to Rock Slide both of them. And then Dragon Dance up. Because Rock Slide will be super effective against Mandibuzz. And it'll do a good amount of damage to Aromatisse. Although, let me... Could just completely set up. Now, old Dragon Dance. Oh, he Tailwind, so he gets faster. Hit him with a Rock Slide. It's super effective, but it barely does anything to Mandibuzz. And he hits me with a Moon Blast, which I resist, because Fire resists Fairy, bro. I'm gonna Swords Dance up with Groudon. And Ice Punch Mandibuzz. He, he hit for Alligator with a U-turn. He's gonna switch out to something. I hope it's like a Dragon type or a Grass type or someone who's still weak to f uh, who's weak to Ice. But it all comes down to whatever he's going to do now. Uh, he switches out to the Weezing, not super effective, but it'll still do a good amount of damage, and it did. And Aromatis wished, I sword danced up, and I'm gonna use Precipitous Blades, because it'll do a ton of damage, and Dragon Dance up with Feraligator. I'm just gonna keep going back and forth and back and forth, switching who heals and who attacks. Oh, he hits me with the Thunderbolt, and it did a ton. I'll Dragon Dance up, so now I'll outspeed, unless he takes me down. He tried Wishing again. I hit him with a... Pr oh, Weezing has Levitate. But it did a ton to Aromatisse, but he just... He, he lived on one and healed back up with Wish. So I'm gonna hit him both with Precipitous Blades again, but it actually isn't gonna hit Aromatisse. So, or it won't hit Weezing. So I'll hit Weezing with a Sheer Force boosted, Attack boosted, uh... Liquid, liquid a or like oh it evaporated in the fire because I'm stupid and I went down, but I hit him with precipitous blades and he levitated and protected from it. 
I'm gonna send out Magnus Owen. Uh. Hmm. Precip all precipitous blades, both of them, and discharge, because it won't affect Groudon. And it will affect Weezing and Aromatis. So that'll be good. Precipitous blades, it, uh, Weezing's immune to it, Aromatis is not. He fire blasts me and he one shot! Oh, that, that, that's painful. Um. I'm gonna send Registeel out. I have three legendaries. He sends out a Topex. I'm gonna rock slide both of them. And. What, why, why would Thunder Wave have to say that it does not, um, uh, it does not ignore type immunities? And then I'm gonna hit Weezing with a. Well, I would have hit Weezing with an Iron Hand, but he went down. So I'll hit Topex with an Iron Head, and it didn't do all that much, but he did flinch. So it, so who's he gonna send? Is he gonna send out the Mandibuzz from before? Someone new that we haven't seen yet? I don't know, you're figuring it out with me. And he does send out the Toucan, and so I'll hit him with a Rock Slide. And then... Mm, sure, I'll paralyze Topex. Rockslide should take out two cannon. Um, 167, 14. Okay, so I am faster. And I rock slide. It Topex protects itself, but it hits the two cannon. And two cannon almost went down, but it got 10%. It got down to 10%, but it flinched. And then Topex was protected from my, um, um, from my thing the uh thunder wave but i'm gonna wait no he's not the i've for some reason i thought groudon was the one with rest so i was gonna sword stance up again and that although he can't really hurt me so why not i'm gonna iron head to cannon i guess he wide guarded so he'd be protected against precipitous blades but i'm not gonna use that hit me with a rock blast and it's doing a lot but I'll live with 36% health. And two cannon went down. I iron headed Topex. And so Groudon is slow. Um, is slow but powerful, but at low health. So we might not get another hit in. He sends out the Zangoose, who is faster than Groudon. I'm going to hit him both with the Precipitous Blades. And then. Um. Iron Head Zangoose. Because it should do a good amount. And the Precipitous Blades, if it hits and, uh, and Groudon isn't just one shot. It Baneful Bunkered. F facade. Yes, he lived the facade. He hit him with the Precipitous Blades. And it one shot. Well, one shot Zangoose. And did uh, the remaining needed damage to Topex. So now it's Mandibuzz versus the world. I. Please don't forfeit. This is the exact situation where a little rat would forfeit. And I don't want you to do that. He, he snarled. Um, so it missed Groudon. And Groudon one shot it with a rock slide. So he didn't forfeit. And that's good. But anyway, thank you all for coming out to another one of my videos. And remember, life's a breezy if you keep it easy peasy, ham and cheesy. Bye.